joined a bit late today because I overslept and uh, apparently signed up for a smashy ride that I didn't know was gonna be so smashy. So it's gonna be zone two, three hours. I don't know how many hours this will be, but it's not zone two. How are you feeling today? Uh, great weather, great friends, great speed, great company. What more can I ask for, man? Vincent seems to have taken some sort of wrong medication in Korea. So now all of us are in the hurt locker. Uh, if you're wondering why he looks so fresh, because some fucker didn't wake up this morning and we've already done about 60 clicks. 60? Yeah, 15 15 Yeah, I'm at 30 now. <laughs> I don't know what Vincent's been eating in his last one month off the bike, but this guy is absolutely killing everybody today. Oh yeah, man. <laughs> Do they sell anything in Korea that makes you like this? A movie. <laughs> And here we got Mikey. Mikey, can you tell the viewers what you've been eating for the last one month we didn't see you around? That turned lots you into of, a monster. Lots of beer, protein uh -huh. shakes, and uh, yeah, that's about it. So beer and protein shakes, the yeah. secret to being fast. Where oh. do you guys start from today? Well, we met at Serene at 6. Um, supposed to be a four-man ride, and I ended up with three. Yeah, but it's cool. We went up Barrow Road, um, then uh, NUS, down South Buena Vista, uh, parallel to the waterfront, and then to Lim Chu Kang, Neotiu, and that's where we met you. That's right. Okay, so we're here at uh, Sinopec now for our breakfast break. Uh, no, this is not Cream Pie Bakery, this is another one. So it's nearby, but Cream Pie Bakery is too far away. Hello, Russia. Mikey, what are you getting? I like that. I don't know. How's it sound to you? No, no, yes. How big are I? 600. So not enough. That's small. Should I just buy? Oh, I know. Buy. No, it is most worth it to buy the dollar for curry. Or the dollar hundred plus. Is that a dollar? If you buy dollar, is it cheaper? Yeah. Yes. Then we take six bottles. You and I share. Okay. Why do? For curry, okay? Yeah. Uh, unless you want uh curry, then you share with. Oh, Vincent absolutely cleared the curry. This is what you get when you take people's pokari. Taking <laughs> <laughs> pokari hoarders, this is like the toilet paper of COVID. <laughs> no, don't dilute your blood. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, today's today you know about right nutrition. Yes. <laughs> oh, then I need to buy something. Mikey, what are you getting? I heard you have a very specific routine. Sugar and light digestion. So much. Any food? Uh, no, just all the things. See, it's the liquid diet that gets you fast. How many do you need? Okay, never mind. We buy first, and then if you need more, we can come in and buy more. What else should I do? Hey, Zach. Why is this so expensive? Any... Any... Preferent of Coffee? Milo? You want a Milo? I'll share with you. 
No, I don't mind. It makes me full. Coconut water? But coconut water is so expensive. That's why. It's $1.95 for the small bottle. What'd you get? Oh, I got a tuna sandwich. What are you looking for? I want this. Uh, there's a pesto chicken. Oh, right. Oh, is it? Wait. Uh, there's your hot of Bokari. Uh, someone once told me that we shouldn't be drinking water for various reasons unknown to me. Big bottles for the big guy. Eh? Yeah, definitely. If you stroke the bottle, it's faster. Tap the bottle, you get more. Every drop counts. Eh? Oh, oh yes. So the three of us have food, huh? Yeah. I tell you, food is very important for cycling, okay? Very. Okay. If you want the endurance, you got to eat, man. There's no way out of it. Basically, the idea of eating is to replenish the calories you lost and with a power meter, that's quite easy. You can see the number of kilojoules you have used uh, in the ride is basically the amount of power multiplied by the time that you have spent riding. And then you work out the number of kilojoules and that roughly converts directly into the number of calories you should have. And the reason for that is because one calorie is 4.2 kilojoules and our body works at 25% efficiency. So, I mean, it's just a way of quick estimation. My friends, uh, we're not on the same level anymore. Why? You have been smashing the whole ride. Now it's just our time to pick the front. Come lah. We won't move so fast. We'll move so fast. Yeah, yeah, we will ride slowly. Are you buying way. breakfast? Eh? Yeah, I'm buying breakfast by the way. Oh. That's why I said we need you all in town. <laughs> no, only a little bow if you only, only if I come all the way? Yes. Okay, solid. <laughs> I am <I'm> motivated. <laughs> the carrot and the stick. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> alright, alright. Okay, we come, we come. Today I learned that this camera does more than just film. <laughs> Apparently when my friends want to leave the right halfway, just pull out the camera and then they're like, okay we stay, we stay. They hold people accountable. <laughs> <laughs> and now they're staying. But we promised them we'll go slow. Hey, why don't you draft the rubbish truck? So you're doing a pit stop here. What do you have today? We have the SIS uh, uh, Go Isotonic Energy. 
pineapple flavor. Uh, this video is not sponsored, mm. but as I asked if you want to sponsor me, reach out. Banana Mika on Instagram. Pineapple flavor. Mm. I heard that makes you taste better. It tastes better. I don't know, I just got liking for pineapple flavor. My, my buddy over there has got some blocks. Okay. Why do you like it so much? Just a little bit of compared to Sorry, right. longer, right? Cliff, you go and sponsor me, Banana Mika on Instagram. <laughs> I'm good, I'm good. Hey, hi, Guan. Yeah, good to you. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Guan always joins at the end of the ride. Yeah. I'm not as strong as them. Maybe we gotta get some SIS, Banana Mika. <laughs> Hi Mikey. How are you feeling? Man, shy. This guy How are your legs? The legs are heavy as hell. We're like six. Oh my god. I wasn't expecting to do this much distance today. Yeah. Mm. But yeah, we're like that's cold. With the French it makes it a lot better. Yeah. Guan and I are the late joiners club. Jeff is the never join club. He's yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the sleeping club. <laughs> We've all been there. Except him lah. Is you going to do an effort later? No. Let me keep clear. <laughs> <laughs> Learning from the old instance. Hey, Guan, your bike and his bike same ah? Mm. Both same time. <laughs> is this legit though? Yeah, it is. It's the only thing that's... Yeah. Sadly, our fresh shit is there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was going to... I was thinking... I was, I was talking to Jukes right the day, then I was saying like, there's a lot of things like, that I was considering. Like, maybe, you know, should I get Thai, Thai training free? Mm, uh, should I get Alu, should I get Carbon? It's like, now it's like, there are all the options. Then like, he was, I asked him, you know, is that better than EI2? Hey, one minute we saw him in SO7. I don't want, I don't want SO. Because to me, I want to keep, I want to ride it like long. Like, and not like him, I like to flip bikes. So we're gonna try the new uh, Coastal Bay PCN today. Just gonna see what happens. I think it's on the left here if I'm not wrong. Wow, look where we are. Oh, nice, good vibes, good vibes. Yeah, man. Nice. What the? I'm getting chills. Oh, I'm gonna show the beat. I'm gonna show the beat. less crowded than we thought it would be yeah yeah we thought it would be pretty crowded today but uh somehow i guess we're quite fortunate today yeah yeah the weather's very nice nice and windy nice and cool not too bad <laughs> actually probably more windy than inside also <laughs> <laughs> yeah but anyway i just wanted to check out this pcn exactly we wanted to check this place out for quite a while already actually. beautiful yeah why is that nice man yes Oh, very nice. Where are we? Like in Taiwan. 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 Taiwan, bro. Look like the Taroko God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, it feels like we're in another country, yeah. Indeed. I think wow. this is as close as it gets to being wow. overseas. They did a good job, uh, finally. Okay, nice let's say finally, cut that out. <laughs> <laughs> did a good job. <laughs> it's a very good alternative to coastal road, I think. Yes. 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 And they very kindly made the roads wide. Yeah, 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 actually. So important. I, I thought there would be a lot more people here today. I think it's a bit early. Oh, and they got real toilets here. Oh, 
Yeah, sure, sounds good, man. Okay, we're gonna stop for a photo here. nutrition on the right yeah. actually normally I don't really eat a lot on the bike because I'm kind of lazy or so so we just have about one stop in between then we eat a sandwich and then we drink and that's about it la. but it's very important last time what I used to do was I just fill up my bottles but something that I realized is very important is to after you fill you gotta drink even more so I always buy two plus one and uh, my plus one of choice it's actually coconut water. I think it's really good. Really freshens me up. Lah. At least it works for me. Seems like they opened a new section of coastal. I've never been here before. Oh, nice. oh, we can actually see the sea. So the view's not bad, huh? Very nice. So we've been following this bunch for quite a while since the end of Coastal. Thanks for the poop. Nice and smooth room. Very nice yeah. and smooth. We have to thank them later. Not a bad effort honestly. Pretty good. These guys look quite strong. Okay, so we're done with the ride. Uh, turned out wasn't that long because I joined late. Got about 108k in. After the ride, we went to 88 for breakfast. And yeah, that was about it actually. So that's pretty much all we eat in the ride. I don't think it's a lot. I think we could eat more. Um, but then it's not very easy to eat a lot when you're on the bike. Usually I tend to eat a bit less thinking that if I have less sugar then I will burn more fat and also I find that my body is quite used to not eating a lot on the bike um, yeah I don't even eat breakfast before I head out I usually put about 200 grams of pasta dry weight okay and that's the end of today's video see ya